Springfield continues to see an increase in the reckless use of guns, including a number of shootings in the past week. Color 10's Ashley Eddy is live from police headquarters tonight after talking to residents disturbed by this trend. Steve Chief Williams says gun violence continues to plague the city. Today I spoke with those who live near some of these shootings. They tell me they're not happy. Continue to work on that issue, uh, but it is going to continue to be a problem uh, moving forward. Springfield Police Chief Paul Williams says the numbers are there to prove it. Gun violence is increasing this year. The, uh, the numbers now we have exceeded, uh, almost exceeded. This is through August. I uh, don't have the September numbers yet, but by the end of the month, we'll have surpassed all of last year in the number of shots fired calls and the number of injuries. Uh, and the number of illegal guns seized by our special investigations unit. We got some good neighbors and whatnot, you know what I mean? But I've noticed the crime is getting really bad. Robin Van Sickle lives near the shooting that happened Sunday on South Glen. And I was in the house and I, my, like I said, my son was outside working on the porch. Come flying down Glen, firing off a clip, turned on Glen onto Mount Vernon and just drove by. You know, and I said, I just want to make sure you're okay. Chief Williams says so there is a variety of ways gun violence occurs. As we've had shootings between uh, people in dispute, uh, either uh, driving or walking or in a fight with someone, and they choose to use a gun to shoot at someone, uh, which you may not hear about, or hit someone, which then you do hear about. When it comes to solutions, he says the department is working on focused efforts. Uh, this is kind of a, a, a plus out of a minus because uh, I have so many vacancies. I've got extra money, if you will, in my budget. Overtime is not an issue. So we see a problem in an area and we do direct patrol and I can, I can, I can put some resources, extra resources, paying officers on overtime to go focus on that area. Now, even though gun violence is currently up, Chief Williams is predicting a 15 to 20 percent decrease in overall crimes being reported this year. Reporting tonight in Springfield, Ashley Eddy, Ozarks First.